friends welcome to elevate with rose this is another episode that i'm gonna be doing today it's more of a teaching for some of you it's gonna be a reminder because uh, i believe this is uh, something some people may be aware of so um, i've been wanting to do this video for some time but i kept um, on pushing it and pushing it but right now i'm gonna do it the other thing is why I'm doing it. Um, I watched two news, uh, like maybe in the last two weeks or so. And like I realized, you know, like maybe I should do this to warn you guys. So first of all, um, there's this lady. Uh, actually, it was a couple. They just did their wedding and they're getting ready to go for their honeymoon. And on the way, uh, uh, you know, somebody who was drunk came and hit them and the lady you know died and then uh, another news um, thing that i was watching is a young girl i bet 16 17 18 year old there or you know but really young and she's capable of driving so she was driving on highway and there were three boys and um i want to believe they were in somewhere like on a bridge you know and they were throwing rocks you know and they were really really huge rocks because i got to see them you know in the news and unfortunately like when they were throwing it fell you know on this lady and this lady died now why am i doing this video is to warn you that you know the bible tell us not to be ignorant you know to always be on the lookout the other thing the bible say is that uh we know that the enemy roars like a lion like a hungry lion actually looking for someone to devour so the thing is uh, when i watch those two videos and many things that have been happening is you know like i don't know whether some people you know know that there is this day in the bible it's called the day of evil you know and one thing i can tell you for sure is that the day of evil um it's you know it's not sent by god it is of course set up by the enemy you know and the enemy purpose the plan is not to leave you you know alive is to make sure that he take you he takes you out and um you know it's very bad to say something that you don't know but i really wonder you know um about you know that lady especially the one who died you know on her way to her honeymoon you know like i wonder you know did, did, did they really spend time praying you know um praying for themselves praying for the day of the wedding you know you see like even when i'm doing this video even though this is not part of what i wanted to say it is always good to uh of course pray as god you know to protect you and do it you know many times not because that god is not gonna protect you but he wants us to keep on you know saying it it is important for uh you also to renew your covenant of life you know after sometimes you know after, you know like maybe you can like in a year you can go for four months you know and then you know when you're praying or even do it daily it doesn't matter you know you tell god you know i'm here and i'm here to renew the covenant of life you know and do the same with your family anyway like i said the video for today is about the day of evil and so uh like i said the day of evil there's nothing that uh, the enemy wants to you know like the enemy's plan is to really like take you out and so when i'm saying this um um, it's to ask you like whenever you're praying um, you can I wish I did write scriptures but one of the scriptures that you can use is to tell God that you know you are I think it's in the book of Jeremiah that says about uh, actually let me look it up real quick yeah it's in Jeremiah 110 that says that uh, God has appointed, you know, God was talking to Jeremiah, he has appointed him as a prophet to nation. And his work is to uproot um, and tear down, destroy, overthrow, build and plant. So when it comes to the day of evil, you know, 
is you know one thing is you know make sure it's uprooted in you in your calendar you know uh you know even when you're praying for your family you ask god you know to uproot this day of evil the thing is you know to tear it down throw you know to overthrow it you know also remember to use the blood of jesus the name of jesus um the other thing whenever you're doing such kind of prayers you should also remember to you know be repentant you know take time to repent and also it's good to really take time to fast so um i really don't want to make it long but i really want to warn you especially now it's summer and um why am i saying especially now it's summer you know the day of evil can happen anytime because the enemy is always looking for opportunity but why i'm saying especially in summer is sometimes people are reclusive of our winter time but when the weather is good everybody's traveling and you know the devil definitely want to do the greatest damage so during this time when people are traveling to um vacations meet their family their loved ones you know the enemy is capable of planning so many bad things so for that reason i i highly recommend that take time before this summer begins pray you know and especially concerning this day of evil uh you know pray for your children pray for your spouses you know pray for your cars sometimes it's good to even anoint them with oil uh you know because you really like these days it's about you know covering yourself because the enemy is everywhere you know like he's like really really literally looking for opportune you know any moment like there's weaken weakness like he can penetrate somewhere he penetrates and he makes sure that he does the greatest damage so i hope you watch this video please like it share with your loved ones and um I pray to God that no harm will come to you. Um, see you guys.